Good uh, morning from Fingal. Well, the weather's actually half decent today. The sun's about to rise. I've got a drone, a camera, a GoPro, and I'm gonna try and capture as much of it as possible. But I just didn't get this plane passing overhead, so we'll give it a shot. <laughs> Sunset, isn't it? Haha. <laughs> yeah, anyway, heaps of sand everywhere. I'm gonna take the uh, drone for a bit of a spin and I guess we'll go from there. Come back up. Okay, so Cully, come on, yeah, it's me. Cully gets a bit cold, and wow. Okay, as you can see, he kind of likes to snuggle up at this time of the morning. Anyway, I need to get the drone up in the air and this thing off my neck. Hey, watch out! You sit, 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 sit. Hey, okay, Cully's not really behaving too bad. Well, it's not really behaving. Anyway, I'm gonna get the drone going, so sticks go in and then push this one up. Good uh, morning once again from Dreamtime Beach. And before I get started, Kelly, come here. It's his birthday. His birthday, he's finally 28, which means he's actually older than me for the next, well, 16 days. Well, really, he's older than me from now on. And yeah, sorry, I think you just saw him pick. Um, I'm gonna get this sunset, sunrise, and that's about it, so. If you want to watch, watch. If not, well, I'll see you soon. The sun's mostly risen and, well, you can see the light's a little bit sort of brighter now. Cully's um, full of sand, tried to dig to China and, well, he just wants to go get his stick, but I'll keep him for two seconds. Hey, he's gone. Anyway, successful morning and time to go give Cully a bit of a present and something special before I have to pack and head off. As you can see, yeah. Oh, at least he's got something to play with. Come 
Okay, so given it's the dog's birthday, and he likes toys, yeah, he knows what he's getting. There's a few things, but to start with, he has a pig, and an oink. And he really wants to play with it, so, huh? take it. You sit up, sit up, yeah. Ah. You sit up. Okay, so as you can see, I'm well in my Econo class flatbed. I've got the uh, three to myself here. The uh, tray table is down enough to take off to make sure that no one else stole it. And yeah, sitting back relaxing. Easy flight. Anyway, hold the fish. As you probably can't see. So, pretty good day outside. Um, a fair bit of clear air turbulence out there at the moment, which is, um, well, as it is kind of described, clear air turbulence just happens with shear layers in well, clear air. Anyway, um, so a bit numpy long route. Uh, yeah, that's about it. Still another hour and a half to go. Board.
So I'm racking up the hours in the uh, passenger seat a little bit too much at the moment. And someone asked me to actually find out how many hours I've done. I don't really want to do that because I'm probably going to be ashamed with the actual number of hours it is. Anyway, my car's... <coughs> just ran into the curb. My car's still here. Um, survived the flight on Jetstar. Easy enough. Um, well, that's kind of what it normally is when you get a 3 to yourself anyway. And yeah, a little bit of turbulence along the way. Anyway, the, um, the rest of my day is going to be fairly boring. I'll... Um, I'll probably jump around to Elstonwick, go to Bumps, get some insoles for my ski boots that I want, and then, not really sure, probably go find someone who wants to grab food. So I'll, um, I'll film a little bit, maybe not too much, and probably see you along the way once I grab my camera. Ooh. And hop in the car. And turn the car. And there we go. Okay, so I possibly went shopping and, well, there was a ski clearance sale on that I went to ages ago and they were asking just huge amounts for things that were kind of obscene. And, um, yeah, anyway, they've cut the prices down huge amounts and I kind of just picked up stuff. Jackets that were $170 odd dollars ended up being $20 a pop for like a merino fleece. So I'm happy and it will keep me warm all winter. Anyway. Time to go get some sushi.